The forthcoming Huawei Nova 7 series is going to be the Huawei Nova 7 Pro, Huawei Nova 7 and Huawei Nova 7 SE. So what are the major differences between these three smartphones under the Huawei Nova 7 series? First, when it comes to display, the Huawei Nova 7 Pro is slightly bigger than the Nova 7 and Nova 7 SE. The Huawei Nova 7 Pro comes with 6.57 Full HD OLED display, while the Huawei Nova 7 comes with 6.53 Full HD OLED display. On the other hand, the Nova 7 SE, which is a more budget-friendly out of these three, will come with 6.5 Full HD LCD display. So the one of the major difference between this display is the Nova 7 SE coming with an LCD display. And when it comes to the fingerprint sensor, the Huawei Nova 7 Pro and Huawei Nova 7 will come with an under display fingerprint scanner. On the other hand, due to the fact that the Nova 7 SE comes with a LCD display, it will feature a side mounted fingerprint scanner. When it comes to the camera, the selfie camera, the Huawei Nova 7 Pro has a rectangular cutout on the left side of the screen which housed the 32 megapixel dual selfie camera on the other hand the nova 7 comes with a 2 megapixel selfie a tiny poncho placed on the left hand side the nova 7 s on the other, on the other hand the more budget out of these two smartphones come with 16 megapixel selfie the rear cameras the nova 7 pro comes with the 4 megapixel cold rear cameras 8 megapixel ultra wide 8 megapixel telephoto and 2 megapixel macro. One of the key features of the Huawei Nova 7 Pro is that it's coming with a periscope camera. As such, 50 times zoom is enabled. Nova 7, on the other hand, comes with the 4 megapixel quadrate cameras, 64 megapixel primary camera, 8 megapixel ultra wide, 8 megapixel telephoto, 2 megapixel depth sensor, but no telescope, no periscope. Our camera enabled. The Nova 7 S Center and comes with the 4 megapixel quadrate cameras but a little below the 7 Pro and Nova 7. It comes with the 4 megapixel camera, 8 megapixel ultra wide, 2 megapixel depth sensor and 2 megapixel macro. So the telephoto camera is lacking. The Huawei Nova 7 Pro will come in two variants, 8 gigabyte RAM 120GB ROM and 8GB RAM plus 256GB ROM. Same with the Huawei Nova 7. The Nova 7 SE will become a little bit lesser with 6GB of RAM plus 128GB internal storage. In terms of battery, the Huawei Nova 7 Pro comes with 4000 mAh battery capacity. All of the variants, Nova 7 Pro, Nova 7, and Nova 7 SE comes with 4000 mAh battery capacity with 4000 watts fast charge enabled. Now the shift set apart these two smartphones, three smartphones, the Huawei Nova 7 Pro will power by the Kirin 985, which is a 5G shift set. Same with the Huawei Nova 7 Kirin 985. Kirin 985 SOC is a little below the Kirin 990 that was featured in the Huawei P40 series. The Nova 7 S on the other hand will be powered by a mid-range Kirin 822 chipset, which is also 5G enabled. So the three smartphones are all 5G enabled. The price of these three smartphones are not yet revealed at the moment. And when they will start selling in the tech market has not yet been revealed. But with the launch of these smartphones coming in a few days' time, more information on those the prices and when it will be available in the market will be unveiled. My HD will be right here on Tech 24 to keep it posted to give you more information about this Huawei Nova 7 series. Not to miss out, you can quickly hit the subscribe button below and join Tech 24 so you'll be among the first to get information first hand. You can also drop your opinion and questions in the comment section below.